Acting Commissioner of the Inland Revenue Department, Jermaine Jarvis, says the hotel sector accounts for most of the revenue loss that was seen in 2020. And when you close down the hotels, you do not, you not only lose the hotel accommodation revenue, but also the hotels consume to provide yeah. food and, and other amenities for their guests. He explains one of the clear indicators of aggregate demand and how this impacts on tax collections. Uh, when we look at the, our measure of, of consumption, which is the ABST, we are only just about two million short of our collections in 2029. 2019. Yeah. Jarvis says there is evidence of a rebound this year. Revenue collections compared to the year 2019, which we'll use as a base year, uh, up until November of 2021, we're actually seeing a 2% increase in collections at the Inland Revenue Department. The acting commissioner says the real estate sector is driving the rebound. You, you have the stamp duty that is performing well and you also have the property tax that's, that's performed incredibly as well. Uh, we are only maybe about 200,000 short of our collection baseline of 2019. Jarvis says an increase in revenues in all areas is projected for 2022, anticipating it to be a very good year for the IRD. Sherilyn Beza reporting for ABS News.